100 and... And... 38, 39... Oh, 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 oh! 142! 3, 4, 5, 6! 146 dead striped bass. Yeah. 47. 148. 149. A striped bass and 200, 300 striped bass. 150, 151, 152. Ah! 70. 170, 171, 172, 173, 174. 178. We got about 200 yards of beach to go. This is a result of the polar vortex. There's no doubt about it. At first, when we stumbled on this mass of broken shards of ice, I just didn't connect it to the fish. It was just, I felt like I had left New England. I had gone to the Antarctic. This is, this is called climate change. You're living in it, people. There's no question, there's no doubt, this is it. This is the result. The polar ice caps are melting. The temperature up north is so much different than it's ever been. The jet stream is allowed to wobble like a drunken sailor. Try to picture it this way. Extreme cold in the North Pole, extreme heat at the equator. Those two temperature gradients provide a stable line for the jet stream to follow. All of a sudden, the sea ice is melting up north, the dark ocean absorbs more heat. Now the jet stream is much more susceptible to fluctuation than ever before. This. We're gonna check it out. We're gonna talk, but odds are pretty good. We're talking the polar vortex has created this fish kill. We've documented 190 striped bass dead on one little stretch of beach. We haven't even gone a mile. Imagine up and down all the beaches. Oh, what do you got? 192, that's a sizable fish, 192. No matter what side of the fence you are on when it comes to climate change, the fact remains, covered in ice, over 200 striped bass are now deceased. You won't be catching any of those fish next year, the year after, and the year after that. That's 200 fish that cannot breed, they cannot interact with other fish in this environment, and they're gone forever. This is the story. This is playing out here right under our noses in New England. 2014 Expedition New England. Stick with us. That just about does it for this episode of Expedition New England. Thanks for joining us. Catch you back next time.